Welcome to Malika Badrinath's Kitchen. This is healthy food, tasty food. I am going to teach you a drumstick sambar with all the tips how to make it very tasty. I will tell all the tips while preparing the dish and before that I will show the ingredients. Please note it down. Three peeled small onions, cooked tuvar dal around 100 grams, sambar powder to 3 teaspoons, tamarind extract, 2 red chilli, salt, mustard seeds, we has black ram dal, cumin seeds, fenugreek, sephotida, oil, curry leaves. Cut this Take it in a microwave proof bowl, add just 2 tablespoons of water, don't add more water. Close with a lid and cook for 2 to 3 minutes. You can even just turn it once after 1 and after 2 minutes. Touch and see, it should be soft like this. In the same way, you can cook onions also in the microwave one just for 2 minutes. Onion always contains moisture. Uh, so sprinkle what, at least just 1 or 2 teaspoons of water and cook for 2 minutes, it's boiled. See, it's soft to touch. If you don't have a microwave oven, you can always cook uh, onions, peeled onions and uh, drumstick in water or thin tamarind extract. Either way you can do it. I'm using tamarind extract here. If you are using tamarind paste, uh, thick tamarind paste which is available in the market, use one and a half teaspoons for that is half cup of tuvar dal, 100 grams of tuvar dal. If you are using tamarind, take medium lemon sized tamarind, soak it in water, squeeze it and then strain it. Wash the tuvar dal once, pour just enough water, there should be little more on top like this you know, uh, on top of the dal. If you add more water also it will not get boiled easily, if you add less water it will become very very thick. Add little turmeric powder, this around half teaspoon or one fourth teaspoon. A teaspoon, less than a teaspoon of oil, any oil, uh, we prefer sesame oil or ghee. This oil will help the tuvar dal to cook, fa cook faster, at the same time it will be very much even. I am adding this drumstick to the tamarind extract, onions, just one slit green chilli. Just to add taste, I am going to add one secret ingredient to make your sambar very tasty. That is, my secret ingredient is fenugreek. Not only mine, all the South Indians who are little elderly, who know how to use this fenugreek in their cooking, which will give a special typical taste to the South Indian sambar. Many people do prepare when, you are, when they are preparing sambar powder in the house, they dry roast this and then add to the sambar powder along with other ingredients. If you are buying sambar powder. This is how it should be prepared. I will just teach you how to do it. This is boiling. It has to boil for some time. In the tamarind extract, your drumstick will taste better. Here I have kept a pan which is very thick heavy kadai. Don't use non-stick vessels for this to roast uh, fenugreek. I am just teaching a very little fenugreek how to roast it. First you have to heat the kadai. It should be really hot before adding this fenugreek. Add the fenugreek. See it should turn light brown, when it turns dark brown it will start spluttering. See this is the uh, time you have to switch off the stove, it starts spluttering one or two. This will be brown. After roasting you have to put it in this and then powder it. This is a very very traditional method which makes the fenugreek, uh, you know uh, uh, if you powder it fresh it will add up taste. Here I have powdered this should be like this. Of course, you can use a mixy jar, that small mixy jar. If you can, roast little larger quantities and powder and keep. For 100 grams of tuvar dal, that is dehashed gram dal, what we call it as, I am going to use 
rock salt around this quantity. The summer powder always depending upon what summer powder you are using. We prepare in the house which will be always coarse like this and we add more dal so that the uh, summer will become thick. You have to add at this stage this is what very important. In the tamarind extract add salt, sambar powder if you want. You can add a little plain red chilli powder also. Add dal, cooked dal, lightly mashed dal to this. Generally in Karnataka they add little bit of jaggery. If you want you can try that. It will be, it will add up the taste. After adding the cooked dal you have to boil it for some more time and then add this fenugreek powder just before removing from the fire. Check the consistency, it should be like this, it should not be not so, so thick, not so thin. This is how it is done. I am going to add fenugreek, roasted fenugreek powder, very little is enough. Always add it at the end, switch off the stove, oil is hot enough. Add mustard seeds, it should start spluttering immediately. Add urad dal, cumin seeds, switch off, add asafoetida in this itself, curry leaves, just one broken red chilli. All the flavours you get you know, it will be very tasty. Pour it on top of. Dumpstick sambar. Mm -hmm.